Hello again! Welcome to my YouTube channel. So earlier, I already uh, uh, soak, uh, what do you call that? Binabad ko muna yung, yung lamp ko. I'm sorry, I'm going to correct it. Yung lamp pala, it's not, uh, it's not kambing. It's tupa. Akala ko kasi it's kambing. So, I'm, I, I got wrong for that. So, I'm so sorry. So, may binabad na ako na, na ano, kanila, like two, uh, for two hours, binabad ko sa suka yung, yung meat ko. But before that, uh, I'm going, I have a guest. So, I'm going to introduce to you guys that I have a special guest. She drove from Kansas City to visit me, to visit us, my family, to help me this cooking video. And I'm going to introduce to you my sister, Gracia. Grace! Hey guys! How are you doing? Yeah. Tutulungan niya ako magluto ng caldereta. Uh, caldereta. So, eto na yung meat ko na binabad ko sa suka or vinegar but um, I already threw away the vinegar so wag nyo isali sa niluto nyo mamaya kasi um, para hindi siya magsour yung yung ano nyo yung kardereta nyo the, uh, the purpose lang na binabad ko yung yung meat para mawala yung langsa anong langsa? Uh, to English? get rid of the was that stinky? Like, if it's if it's fish, it's like fishy flavor. But yeah, it's like, like that. The stinky flavor. Yeah, because it's different, right? The stinky smell yung, of the lamb. Yeah. Yung, yung, may amoy. May amoy talaga yung lamb, di ba? So okay. Uh, here's my sister Grace. Tutulungan niya ako sa pagluto ng kaldereta, and she has also coming soon. Yeah. Say hopefully it. Hopefully soon. I'm going to have my. YouTube channel, not just cooking, just anything, everything, everything, and makeups, right? Dancing. <laughs> okay, so. so let's start, guys, to cook the caldereta. Yung gagamitin natin yung tupa na karne or oh, lamb, at saka uh, potatoes, carrots, onions bell pepper tomato garlic at saka, what do you call this? Thai chili Thai chili brown sugar like one and a half tablespoon lever spread it will help thicken the sauce and yeah, the texture of the sauce tomato sauce and of course we're going to use garlic powder Pepper and salt to taste. So, magumpisa na tayo. Let's start. Um, we still gonna use a uh, coconut oil. Maglagay tayo ng like one tablespoon. Ayan. Gracia. I'm gonna be the one who's yeah. going to saute this. Help me for this. Masarap talaga kapag may asista na, no? Okay, so first, we'll let it, the oil heat it. Mm -hmm. first. Okay, first we're going to saute the garlic. Mm -hmm. So yeah. basically, this is just a crushed garlic, it's not minced. So we're just gonna crush it. So this is just crushed garlic. Yan yung tayin lang natin, na mag brown yung a little bit. garlic. Then we're going to add what next? This. The meat. Uh, as soon as the garlic is a little bit brown, we're going to put the meat. Just one at a time. Yeah, para hindi ma sama yung remaining vinegar na na inano ko kanina. Na binabad ko kanina. So, wag niyo isama yung yung suka o yung vinegar na binabad sa karne. Para hindi mo magsour yung Yung niluto niyo. So basically, we drain the vinegar. Mm -hmm. There you go. So, ano na siya? Medyo brown na. Konti. Medyo brown na. 
Mm -hmm. And all the liquid has evaporated. Mm -hmm. So we're going to add in our what? Our tomato? Yeah, tomato. Add in our onions. Mm -hmm. Lots of onion, guys. Lots of onion. Masara po yung bumbay. The more onion, the merrier. Iba bumbay yan sa ano? Sa Tagalog? Sibuyas din. Ay. <laughs> sa ayun po, siguro yung bumbay. <laughs> <laughs> Sibuyas pala. So if they don't have red onion, can they um, use white, white onion. or yellow onions? Mm -hmm. Okay. So it's yeah, any it, onions. So it can be optional. Mm -hmm. oh, we need to add uh, salt before we're gonna put uh, uh, water. Imply natin konti. Kasi earlier, nang binabad ko yung meat, when I the meat the vinegar, I already put salt and pepper. So meron na siyang lasa uh, sa meat konti. So, so adding salt and pepper, it will soak in the flavor into the meat mm -hmm. there you and go. garlic powder I can't wait to eat this are you guys no. excited it's still the same flavor right the the kambing or the goat and the lamb. maybe the goat is a little bit stronger I don't know I've never had I never uh, I had goat I before I had yet. lamb but I think the goat is stronger because I had both. I had goat before and lamb. But I bet again it depends on how you cook it and how you season it. So it won't have that stinky, funky smell. It's not really stinky, it's just kind of funky smell from the, the lamb. We'll add we in. add two cups of water. Cups of water. Para sa, what do you call that? To make our meat tender. Yes. So like, takpan lang natin like. Uh, okay, so we're going to boil this for 15 to 30 minutes. To 30 minutes until or until the, the lamb is tender. There you go. After like 30 to 40 minutes, para na tender na siya, di ba? Oh. Yeah, so now that our meat is tender, tender. we're going to add in our potato and carrots. Potato. And stir, stir, stir. And our carrots. Carrots. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, our meat is so tender. Uh, it's gonna be, oh, it will just melt in our mouth later. And then, and then we will simmer this for how long? Like three minutes? Three minutes, yeah. We will let it simmer until the potato and carrots are cooked. After three minutes. Now our potato and carrots are cooked. And then we're going to add a bell pepper. The rest or the rest of the ingredients. Yes. Yeah, we're going to add our bell pepper. Mm -hmm. And then our, we want to add in our liver spread. Liver spread. Guys, you can also use... Uh, the real liver. Mm -hmm. They could use. We'll also liver. thicken the sauce, but if you don't want to have the texture of the real liver, you can just use a liver spread or liver. We call it liver pate. Okay, let's add in our sugar. Oh, it smells so good. Yeah, we could put after this. We could put the tomato sauce. Okay. Oh, look at that. Look at the texture of the sauce. So as soon as all the ingredients are incorporated, we're going to add in our tomato sauce. sauce. So we're going to add in our tomato mm -hmm. sauce now? Yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that tomatoey color. We don't need to add any liquid, right? That's all. Yeah, that's all. Because we, I don't want, like... it, we want it thicker. Yeah. We'll have a thicker I sauce. I like, like saucy saucy. It's not like sabaw. Hey, baby pal. So we'll probably simmer that for two minutes. Oh, we're going to add in the the last ingredient, which is our Thai chili. Yeah. To add some spice. Yeah. If you guys you don't like uh spicy, mm -hmm. you don't need to add it. But you know, yeah. it's we like it spicy. Yeah. Or you can add those long pepper. I don't know the name of those, but those long peppers. They're those are not 
uh, really so spicy. spicy, but this one is a bit spicy, like next to the ghost pepper. And then we are going to try if it, uh, uh, it tastes. We're going to taste it? Yep. Okay. And then if we need to add, um, what do you call that? If we need to add uh, salt, salt or, or pepper, pepper. Let's try. Or garlic powder. I'm going to be the taster. I'm hoping I'm not going to burn my tongue. Do we need to add something? No, for me it's perfect. Just a little bit probably. Just mm. a little bit, but yeah. it tastes good for me. Just a little bit. Because if we add it to our, you know, rice, then that's enough now, I think. And pepper. So it's always depends on how your taste, guys. If you like salty, then you can add yeah, more salt. If you I don't agree. Like salty, then... Kasi iba't iba tayong panglasa. Yes. So you need to uh, estimate na lang kung ano yung panglasa nyo. But it's perfect. I give it a thumbs up. And you need to you need to try the meat too. If it's uh, really tender or show oh. it to them how tender it is. Oh my gosh. How can I? I think we could just like slice oh my gosh we could just break the the yeah. meat with our spatula it's really tender it's so tender so i think it will just melt in my mouth i can't wait mm. guys it's so, so good. good huh yes it will just melt in your mouth uh put it over rice it's perfect okay let's eat I'm not exaggerating, guys. This tastes so good. Mm. 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 Very tender. Seriously. Very tender. The sauce is just right. Mm. All the flavor of the vegetables and stuff, you can taste everything. Yeah. And mm. it really does make a difference when you put a liver sauce or a liver pate or a liver spread. Because it does really thicken the sauce. You don't need to put cornstarch or anything. Mm. Perfect. Mm. So good. So guys, if you like the way we cook the caldereta. So what is called that? The tupa in Tagalog. The lamb. The lamb, yeah. Uh, if you like the way we cook, please subscribe and like to my YouTube channel. And share. And share. Please share. And do it to your uh, to your family or to your house. Please do it and cook. Try it. It really tastes so good. Mm -hmm. And thank you guys for watching. And, and thank, thank you, you to my, my sister. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Uh, it's so fun. And it's so uh, easy if you have assistance. Exactly, right? <laughs> yeah, right? So guys, thank you so much. Please watch my uh, cooking video at my YouTube channel. And have a good day. Have a blessed day. Thank you, Sister Grace, for helping me. And abangan you guys. He has a, a YouTube too soon. So please Maybe. Maybe uh, we'll watch. See. Yeah. At marami po kami gagawin to my YouTube channel. Yeah, Dancing her and you are going to do our tandem. So. Yes, me. It's a sister's. I don't know. We're going to make names for that. Oh, guys, thank you so much. I love you yeah, all. Thank you for watching. Thank Bye. you for watching. Bye. Bye.